Hey Leos, welcome to your reading. It is, you know, it's been Leo season for a while now, but I like to call the entire month of August my birthday month um, because I am a Leo son. Um, but yeah, I, it excites me when August has started. Um, yeah, okay, so I'm gonna do, I've decided today to do a you versus them Leo. I'm going to probably be doing daily Leo readings for the entire month of August just because I love us. That's all I have to say. Okay. <laughs> um, so yeah, you versus them. I'm going to do you here and them here, whoever they is. Male or female doesn't matter. They may pull up as masculine or feminine depending on the energy. It doesn't mean a thing. They can be any gender or no gender or whatever you want to be. It doesn't matter. Okay. Oh my gosh, I had actually like a really a good day. It was good. I was really tired because um, of the full moon. Uh, you know, going to do a little bit of rituals here and there during the full moon. So I'm a little exhausted today. But it's all good. All protection rituals, by the way. I don't play any of that black magic nonsense because I don't need it. Okay. So, Leo, I'm going to get a general vibe here first with the moon cards. What's going on for Leo? Show the world the real you. Conclusions are within reach. I feel like these came out the other day for Leo again. I feel like this is just this is just a message for you, Leo, to just stop. If if you feel like you've been holding yourself back for some reason, it's now time to take take advantage of this full moon in Aquarius that is literally happening today. Okay, so I'm hoping I'll release this tonight for everyone, but um, it may be tomorrow, depending. Also, you are good enough, full moon in Virgo. So some of you may have Virgo in your chart as well here. Um, where am I going? This is where I'm going. I'm going here. Okay. Okay, I'm going to get three cards for Leo over here with my Situations Oracle, then uh, three cards for their person. So let's get three cards for Leo. Threatened in reverse or threatened as a challenge. So you could feel threatened by someone, Leo. Magnetic, unexplainable, pull, can't resist. Okay. So you definitely have some sort of soulmate connection here or something or someone that you just can't, okay. Well, you know, there's just gonna be a bunch of cards instead of three, that's fine. So you have some sort of historic past. This could be a past life with someone. Um, you could be feeling trapped regarding it here with lockdown, mental prison, confined, but this is definitely someone that you are, that is a very genuine connection, okay? Sorry, I'm running out of space. <laughs> okay, let's get three cards for Leo's person. Three cards for Leo's person. Interlude in reverse. Drastic in reverse. Someone may have ghosted you, Leo, or perhaps... I'm getting like, I'm getting a feeling from this that someone is just, they're not messing around anymore, okay, with you. They they want to be with you, but let's see. What else? For Leo's person. Escapade. Vacation, hideaway, adventure. From, um, <laughs> from this, I'm getting someone really wants to, like, take you somewhere, okay? Ooh, that's interesting. Why oh, don't need to do this again? Okay, what's threatened for Leo? Knight of Wands. Okay, that's an interesting vibe. I really like this Knight of Wands card, by the way, here. I don't know if you can see it very well. But I'm seeing like a, a castle of some sort. I'm seeing the colors red and black. Someone who dresses kind of fancy. <laughs> this could be too, like someone, or maybe you used to be threatened of this person, but I feel like you're kind of stepping into your power with them. You're no longer afraid. You're being very courageous. And 
I'm getting your crown chakra is lighting up as well. What's magnetic here for Leo? King of Wands. Damn. Okay. Yeah, you have someone that you were really attracted to here, and they are very attracted to you, Leo, here with the King of Wands. But I'm also getting a story with them. Judgment in Reverse, Ten of Coins. Okay. I'm going to have a lot of cards out here, so <laughs> just to let you know, my entire table is going to be filled up. Okay. So someone here. This King of Wands made a bad decision at one point. This may have been against you. This could have been just a karmic situation for them, but whatever it was, it's almost like they knew they made the wrong decision when it happened. I'm feeling that you've always been this person's ten of coins, you know, you've always you've always meant something. Okay, so what's history with genuine love and lockdown? Okay, Seven of Cups, yeah, Four of Wands, Queen of Cups, King of Cups in Reverse. Okay, your past life with someone is what is causing them to be emotionally unavailable, okay? Um, your person recognizes you, they know who you are. With this Queen of Cups here, this is you, I believe. You could also have water in your chart somewhere. There could also be more than one person in this situation, and you all share a past life somehow, and you're all coming together in this life to kind of figure it out. I saw it was really thirsty. Okay. Whew. Man. Cold liquids on a hot day are so good. Okay. <laughs> Interlude for your person here. <clears throat> Five of Swords. Someone feels trapped. Or they did feel trapped in the past, and that's why they... Or they somehow trapped themselves doing something. What's drastic in reverse? The tower. Okay. Leo, your person here is going through some sort of emotional turmoil. Um, they, they did something. They could have done something to you that you don't know about. It's like eating them alive. Ouch. Okay. Escapade. What's escapade? I don't like this for a birthday reading for Leo. Come on. Yeah. The world. Okay. I feel like some of you or this person is going to be traveling towards you or your guys are going to be traveling somewhere or travel is happening somewhere. Why is this in reverse? What? Okay. I now see the high priestess and the magician in reverse. I'm actually getting this as you and your person. Okay. Sorry, I just noticed that at the bottom of my deck, it was like reversed. So I don't know, some of you could be into divination, some of you could be a healer. Um, your person could be an Aquarius or some sort of earth sign as well. With, yeah, this is interesting. I'm getting divine couple from this, so this might be why your, your relationship is so weird. Oftentimes, divine couples don't actually meet each other when they're, like, single or available. They meet each other once they become whole or, like, the best version of themselves they can become before they meet their counterpart. Okay? So, threatened here with the judgment. Okay, so, because your person, your person was a bit threatened by you for some reason in the past. Okay, and this is why they made a stupid decision to do whatever the hell they did. Okay? We're going to find out what that was. What was this decision over here that... Yeah, okay. Some of you are definitely dealing with an Aquarius. This person could also have a Libra Venus here with the King of Swords in reverse. Um, 
your person may have manipulated you or lied to you about something and this is what i'm getting over here is their tower because leo i'm getting that you've been like sweet to them the entire time and this is just like i'm getting like whatever it is eats them alive inside because you've not you've never you haven't done anything wrong it's like you've always told them the truth and this person may have been cold to you because of some sort of impatience that they had or who's this king of swords Yeah. <laughs> Someone can have an Aquarius Uranus here with the Fool in reverse as well. Um, this person was just afraid of the unknown. They're very comfortable where they were. They weren't intending on moving anywhere. However, they wanted to come towards you with, because you, you make them curious. You like inspire their curiosity here. You ignite their inner child. You strengthen their intuition somehow, or this could be you coming towards them. You know, maybe because you were like this, it awakens that inside of them. And they like that. Okay. Who's this uh, page of cups here? Yeah. For some of you, this is them. Um, they There was some sort of failure here in the past. There was some sort of wrong decision. Someone had lost focus here. And here we go with the Hierophant. Okay, so something that you've said to this person recently maybe has awakened them. Okay. I feel like they're ready to come towards you now. Someone could also have a Taurus Venus. I'm getting lots of Libra in this reading. Okay. So what happened over here with the, oh, what is this again? The magnetic with the four of wands and the ten of coins. What is this? Or no, that was over here. Sorry. What's with the magnetic and the king of wands with the ten of coins? It's like, you know what I'm getting for this? It's like this person knew the whole time that you were meant for them. It's like they knew it inside, but it scared the shit out of them. Yeah. Yep. This feeling, this person has really romantic feelings for you. This is, could also be a new person coming in towards you because this past person has just like burned all the bridges with you. This person either has a new sense of sensitivity and charm and romance, or this is someone new. Who's this uh, Knight of Cups here? Okay, this is you here um, as the Queen of Wands. Whoa, hello. There's my story. Okay. <laughs> so there's a third party situation here. So we have a Queen of Wands. We have a Queen of Cups. This Queen of Cups is has a tendency to be a bit obsessive, impatient, and stable, disloyal. This person was creating some sort of emptiness in this person here. This is why things failed in the past, okay? Like, I, I think for some of you, this person went towards this Queen of Cups and caused a stalemate between you two, and they may have lied about it. They may have told you something else and something else happened. Yeah, okay. Here with the last section here with the history and the ten or what was it? The King of Cups reversed, yeah. Yeah. And the Queen of Cups up right here. Um self doubt. They this person has they ignored their intuition. Alright. They know who you are. It's like inside of them they know there's something about you that's meant for them but they're just like completely they may be afraid to come towards you because they know it would be a lot of work okay who's what's this over here This person could be fixated on material goods. They could want something that looks better to people around them. They could be concerned with other people's opinions. 
They're also very possessive, so they're unwilling to let you go, but they do put in bare minimum effort here. What's the Four of Pentacles? Mm, yeah. <laughs> There's you, Leo, as a strength. You know what's annoying to me about this is that you give this person so much hope and strength and you are very playful and all of these things and they give you bullshit. They give you like the bare minimum. Because you know and they know that you guys are probably some sort of like soulmate couple and they just decide to keep ignoring it. And they'd rather play with this Queen of Cups in reverse over here that probably is, they're nothing compared to you, Leo. You're gorgeous, you're artistic, you're, you have all the things going for you and this person's like just pathetic, whoever this is. They're annoying, okay. What's the Five of Swords here for your person? The timing, factor, pause, and reverse. Yeah. Okay, so your person has recently received a message somehow, maybe during a moon period here. Um, <clears throat> they're coming into their power here with the high priestess. She's showing, she's showing up twice, actually. So maybe your person, this could just be you and their energy. Perhaps you said something to them. Perhaps you said something somewhere. Um... This person either broke up with someone or is fearing a breakup with you. Um, they're, they're also very imbalanced here with the Two of Pentacles in reverse. What is this with the High Priestess? Yeah, your person has no direction. <laughs> they could have been chaotic in the past. I don't know if this is past energy or something that's going on current. I'm getting it's kind of past, okay, because I, I see this like tower moment here. So this tower is either about to happen or it's happening now. Well, I mean, I guess that's kind of about to happen, right? <laughs> Yeah, this you guys are lining up with the missed opportunity here because this is the can't, the Knight of Swords in reverse is a missed opportunity in this first row and over here on your first row there's this missed opportunity because they did something with someone somewhere, but in the process they also screwed you over somehow. They may have lied. Yeah, they were being greedy. They just had a lot of, <laughs> it's just greed. Greed, greed, greed is all I'm seeing here. This person is very greedy or was very greedy. Like they wanted their cake and they wanted to eat it too and they didn't give a shit who they, they didn't give a shit who they fucked over. It was very cold of them to do this. They, at that time, I feel like they were very unawakened. They may have known that they were attracted to you, but they didn't realize who you were, Leo. Okay? What's this tower over here? This tower moment with cut off, harsh, extreme. Leo, you could have even decided to cut this person off because you're just sick of the bullshit. Yeah. Okay. I feel like this might be you or them. Someone's cutting someone off here, and this could just be them cutting off this Queen of Cups if they're still in this energy. Your person is actually in very feminine energy right now, Leo, so um, I, I got that I was talking to a male Leo yesterday too, but it, it doesn't have to be. I just feel like your person is in very feminine energy. They could be coming into emotion or like erotic emotion, if that makes sense, like just distorted feminine behavior, you know. They're very pessimistic, rude, lack of empathy. With the uh, hanged man in reverse, this, there they are again, stalling something. And maybe because they're stalling, you're deciding to cut them off. You're just like, you know what? If you want to keep ghosting me, you can go fuck yourself, right? What else here with the tower?
Yeah, because they keep being indecisive with the Eight of Cups in reverse. They avoid you. Do you know why they avoid you? They avoid you because they know they fucked you over in the past. They may have even, like, said something to this Queen of Cups. They may have even, like, gossiped about you to someone. And you have never in your life even said anything negative about them. Or if you did, it was because they were being so weird, you know? It's because they have low self-esteem because you, this person is threatened by you. Sorry, I just got... <laughs> like, I was just like, for some reason, I decided to throw these cards. And I... I, I there's probably a reason. Yeah, okay. Um, for some of you, you're canceling this. Uh, you may be breaking up with this person. With the Three of Cups in reverse. I'm just getting like a really annoyed vibe right now. It's just like, ew... There was just too much loss here. There was too much trauma. With the Three of Pentacles, it's like... There was just too much struggle trying to work with them. It's like they kept ghosting you and leaving. And here with the Ten of Swords in reverse, it's like... You're at the point where I can't. it just can't get worse. Like, what, what are you going to do? Ghost me one more time? Oh no, I'm so scared. Right. Okay, I'm getting cross your energy right now. I don't know if you're watching for a Leo. For some of you, I'm getting this as a cloaked situation where you're actually watching this for someone else that's a Leo feminine or something. That's weird. Okay. So for some of you, your person is actually leaving someone behind here that's maybe watching this and that's why I'm getting this energy because I feel like I'm, they're coming back towards you here with the escapade. Okay, this could also just be why this person was ghosting you was because this person was still in their energy and they were talking shit or something. Okay, what's the escapade over here in the end? Why did I just get that weird cloaking energy? That was strange telling you the full moon will like they'll just it'll just expose everyone so don't think you can get away with that shit if you're watching and you're not a leo <laughs> i'm just kidding guys you can watch if you're a leo or not a leo but like if you're watching to like try and spy on someone go fuck yourself sorry um here with denial and still i mean there's a there's like spying to like you know to like help improve your situation i don't mean just like go fuck yourself but also like if you're spying on someone because you have ill intentions then you should go fuck yourself okay but if you're like just trying to figure out what's going on that's a different story um here with escapade um someone could just be taking a break right now there's some sort of stalemate in the situation someone here is relaxing okay what else with that with escapade yeah, this person was just working too hard. They had a lot of... Uh, here it is with the competition. Like, I don't understand this reading today. What's the five of wands? Yeah, okay. For some of you, I am getting that someone has been left out in the cold here, and they're actually going to come towards you with some sort of message. They're a past person with this person. They could be, have been the person that they, like, fucked you over with or whatever here. <laughs> they've been broken up with, and they've been talking mad shit, too. They could have been talking mad shit to your person. However, I do see them coming towards you with some sort of... With, pers with a, some sort of lie... What is this? <laughs> Your person is holding on to you here, though, um, with the Three of Wands and the Knight of Wands. Like, I feel like they're going to come back around here. I don't know if they've just gone kind of AWOL or, like, you know, they're just chilling. I don't know. Um, I want to get more situation cards. This is interesting. What's this past energy right here? This past energy. What was this lie? Yeah, drama queen. Synchronicities. Your person just was not awakened yet, and there was some sort of thirsty wench in their energy. <laughs> like, they could have just been, like, more immediately available, and that's why they went to them. Like, I'm getting Leo. You're the type of person that's just not going to, like... 
you're probably not gonna just throw yourself at someone so like whoever this was and and this person's past was just like easy like they were just like a hoe you know what I mean and the reason why I'm calling them a hoe is because they're a hoe because they're talking shit about you now and they're trying to cause trouble if you sleep around and like that's your thing I don't care like, or if you're just like open sexually that's not a big deal I'm talking about people that like mean ill intentions towards others just because they they want to like stay a third party for no fucking reason Okay, what's this uh, history here? Lost, yeah, okay. Denial in reverse. Your person knows. They they recognize who you are now. Um, in the past, they did ghost you a lot. They blocked you a lot. They cut you off a lot. Especially if they were starting to become emotional, they may have just decided it would be easier to ghost you because they're not used to feeling this way, so they probably were just like, I don't know what to say right now, like, this is too much, like, this is a, I'm getting like, it's kind of like, this is the time when I would hug them, or this is the time when we would bang or something and just get over it, but you couldn't do that or something. Okay, um, oh. Pop up in reverse, spontaneous unexpected surprise visit. There could be some sort of cancellation. Why is there a cancellation? Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. For some of you, they have canceled some something with someone in the past here with denial in reverse. So everything that you have coming towards you is on the table. I'm also, also the Twin Flame card came out. Yeah, so we have the Twin Flame card here. Um, I think you're just dealing with an unawakened twin. <laughs> okay. And they can be really fucking annoying sometimes. Like, they may, like, they just don't understand what's going on. It's like they know something's going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. TikTok, motherfucker. Okay, so... This person is probably feeling, your person is probably feeling super anxiety right now, Leo. Um, they just, and there is a deadline here. I'm getting, this person is, could be going through some sort of tower moment or test right now. And this could be why they're quiet as well. Um, you're also being protected by your spirit, the universe here from seeing something that you don't want to see okay I don't know what it is it could be some sort of sexual thing I don't know if I don't know if it is it's one of those things where they're like okay the universe is like okay dude like or girl like here's one more person that you can try and get along with and let's see if it works and then they meet them and then they're disappointed again <laughs> it's just like it's just and you're probably going through this like 50 million times and you're just sitting here like yeah okay whatever you know um yeah let me see what's anxiety racing running <laughs> Yeah, you you uh you have a runner twin here. <clears throat> so the type of behavior you might experience is like I said, anytime they're feeling emotional, they will ghost you because they either don't feel like they can they don't feel good enough for you or they're angry with you for being the only one they can relate to. And the reason why you're the only one they can relate to is because you guys are one soul split up at birth. Okay. All right. So what's racing? Bounty hunter reverse. Yeah. You're no longer chasing them either. <laughs> Leo, you're probably just like sitting there. Like you're like, I can see you just sitting here being like, like TikTok motherfucker. And you're just like, <laughs> like waiting, like on your throne. Like, okay, are you done? Like being a dumbass? Like, when do you want to start being cool? Right. You're just done. All right, uh, who's this drama queen right here? Let's get more on this bitch. What are you? What are you doing, bitch? What do you? I even feel like I don't know. Maybe she's like watching this reading, which is weird. It's like, leave the Leo alone. 
Ascension, spiritual path awakening. Yeah, this, this person, this karmic, they were just part of this person's past uh, and path um, in a sense. Like they needed to be with this person for some reason because it made them realize something about you. Okay. What's Ascension here with Drama Queen? This person, that whole moment as well may have helped you ascend. There was some sort of like, like universal plan for that. Okay. Journal in reverse, writing, diary, keeping notes with happiness. What's journal in reverse with happiness? Triggers. Okay, for some of you, I just got the message, this person, this person that this someone is with was like writing really negative things about you to them or something. They're trying to trigger this person as well to come towards them. What's triggers? Recalling. Your person is not even interested, which is kind of funny. Yeah, they're coming towards them with some sort of offer, um, but they're not interested at all. Okay, what else? <laughs> What's going on with this? That's funny. Realization, focus, yeah. Your person is now realized and focused on you here, Leo, so if there is a stalemate, you know, I feel like you guys are going to connect very, very, very soon. I want to get, what's this Twin Flames card here? What's this Twin Flames card? Twin Flame came out for you guys the other day too, Leo, like, Leo season's bringing everyone together. Lockbox with crickets in reverse. Yeah, this person's going to reach out very, very soon, okay? They're going to they're gonna say something, okay? They're going to tell you how frustrated they are. They're going to tell you something like, man, I really want to F that B, you know what I mean? Like, I really just want to, I just really want to lay it on you, okay? A situation. Ooh, yeah. You know what landed over this bed? The Queen of Cups reverse. I, I flipped it over. Karmic. Ah, karmic bitch. <laughs> and the reason why we get to laugh at them is probably because they're a ruthless, wretched, cold hoe. That's why. <laughs> you probably did nothing, Leo. You're probably just, like, sitting around being yourself. And this person's like, ew, like, how, like what you like them like they oh they have like a big nose or like oh look at their stupid eyes or like oh look they have fat on their body or something and you're just probably sitting there like you have no idea this is even happening and your person probably hasn't told you because they don't i mean honestly if someone says something negative about someone i know i don't normally tell them unless it i need to most of the time i just ignore it so that's probably what happened there by the way, your person is still listening to you. If you are trying to talk to them, they will respond, okay? This isn't goodbye yet. They're not, they just need a little moment here, which is maybe what this escapade is about. They're probably going through a tower with this crazy ass fucking karmic bitch, and that's why they're being silent, okay? You're mine. I get so pissed knowing other people can have you. This could be this karmic coming in trying to be like, you're mine, like, I want you and stuff, and they're just like, ew, what? I don't like you anymore. You look weird. Sorry. Sometimes I get to be a little crazy, right? You feel like home came out in reverse. Yeah, this is this person just being like, you're not for me, like, I don't really, I don't really think of you like that. Okay. What else here for this? What else? Get some more. Let's get all the cards. Oh yeah, more. Playing games came out in reverse, guys. This person is done playing games with you, okay? There's this isn't happening anymore. They are feeling a little lost without you, and they think you're super smart. Um, is it true? Are you dating someone in reverse? So they are not, they're not seeing anyone else right now, they're just chilling, okay? Um, they're probably just dealing with telling this person to go F themselves. And they're probably, like, coming back at them with, like, crazy shit. And they're like, oh, God. What have I done? I, I messed with the... <laughs> they stuck their D in crazy is what happened. Okay. Leos, that was fun, wasn't it? <laughs> All right, everyone have a nice day. Bye.